Sophia Lena and this is me living and yes I'm driving and yes I was in traffic and you know what traffic teaches so much we can learn so much from traffic because as I was sitting I was what was I it was taking the 101 and like getting on the 110 towards San Pedro and the what there were three lanes that you could take towards uh, to get on the, the 110 towards San Pedro and the two other lanes on the left were flowing but the one you know the transition lane right where everybody's getting over from the 101 and the 10 and everything and coming into the one lane it was just stopped because there was a bus that was trying to get onto the 110 into the 110 lane and a car was refusing to let them in multiple cars were refusing to let the bus in and I'm watching this happen as you know I've seen it gosh every day pretty much every single day and I'm sure you see it too and maybe you're one of those people that just no you should have gotten over way back there. Why are you getting in this lane now? No, you missed your chance. No, they didn't. They didn't miss their chance. You're not letting them in. It's not personal. Nobody is trying to get over to cut you off as a human being. It's not personal. They don't know you. They're just on their own journey and they're making their own choices. And so our responsibility then is to make our choices and our choices I mean my choice is to choose love and the message that I got as I was sitting in traffic and I was witnessing this was that life isn't gonna flow unless we allow it to right so I got a message then to let every car I just, to stay in that lane and let every car that needed to get over get over and, you know, the, the lane started moving. Finally, somebody let the, the bus in, and I was letting cars in in front of me. And it wasn't keeping me. It didn't slow me down to the point where I'm going to be late and I'm going to miss out on things. And I know that the people that are getting over last minute are just getting over last minute. That's where they are and where I am is in a place of love and allowance to help the flow so I invite you to allow the flow to move because if we're stagnant and we're stuck and we're resisting and we're fighting then there's no flow it's it's yeah it's stagnant stagnancy is yucky doesn't feel good. Stagnant water is gross, right? Stagnant energy is also icky. So that was my traffic lesson and I, I learn it all the time. Today I felt compelled to share it. So when you're in traffic or you know literal traffic on the freeway or on the road, don't take other, uh, other people's driving choices personally and choose how you want to react choose how you want to allow the energy to flow you want to stop it because you want to judge them and their choices or do you just want to allow it and continue loving and living and flowing freely choice is yours always so join me in choosing love and allowance and letting life flow. So in the flow, the traffic flow of your life energetically, you can look at that and apply this lesson to everything. <laughs> everything! You're in a relationship that's stagnant, stuck. Where can you allow it to flow? Where can you allow it to flow?
choice is yours. I already said that. Okay, I'm gonna go now. I love you. Bye.